So based upon this, the KMNO4 uh, potassium permanganate, you might look at the formula weight, okay? It's about 158, okay? Something like here. <clears throat> and you do, you can do the back calculation or do the stretch calculations. And we're going to make it at 0 0.0200 molar. So based upon that formula weight, right? So you're going to add 3.161 grams per liter of the DI water, okay? But we're not going to make Two, we're gonna make two liter, okay? So meaning 3.161 times two. So it's gonna be about 6.322, okay? So this is what I have. I already pre weighed this one, okay? It's almost there. So we're gonna add a little bit more, okay? So we have about 5.9, okay? I just take a little dab, okay? Gently, okay? That's it, 6.322, right? So this, you're gonna be very careful, okay? I add a little bit more than this yet. 6.3, that's about good. 6.3, a bit too little, little much. I take it out. 6.3, okay, a little bit. And the way I do it, I, I just tap it on here, you see it? Little tap. On, on the spatula, okay? And it's dropping a little bit small grains onto the wave board, okay? Remember 6.322, right? A bit off, too much, okay, be gentle. A little bit more, a little bit more, okay? Six point three two. That's close. Okay, I call for it. Okay, six point three two two. So that's just about right. So the next step we're gonna do, pour it in the DI water. I already made a few. The first two, I'm gonna make about ten liter. Okay, so you you may see what I'm doing. So I'm gonna create the whole batch. Okay, so this is gonna be quality control and tested. So after. And this one is the two liter volumetric flax. Already start spinning, okay? But make sure when you volume up all the way up to here, you see a little line right here. You need to QS quality sufficient up to two liter portion, okay? And here I go. It's about 6.322. Gentle on top. And then you, you, you shoot it straight in, okay? You see that? Okay, okay, I'm gonna drop it. See the color? And then I'm gonna rinse out with the DI water in here, okay? You see the color? Okay. And then I'm gonna just use the DI water, rinse out the whole thing, and quality is sufficient up to that point right here, okay? So just hold on a second, let me grab it, okay? And this is my DI water. Okay. So we go to the first one. Let it sit right there. You see? A little, a little bit, you see it. You see it. Any bit, it's okay. So I'll try it to get it in, okay? Rinse out. Okay. Do it one more time. Okay, so this one about good. Our next step, okay. Let me see. Do I do it? Okay. I just squeeze the bottle here, you see it? I squeeze it. And I be very, very careful, okay? And you cannot go overboard, okay? Hold on a second, I got there. Maybe I use this. Oh, hang on, okay? All the way. Hold it. Almost there, right? And here you go. Let's see. Getting close, right? And then remember the minutes cost, right? You need to go about the bottom curve to the minutes cost reading point, okay? About there, about there, I think it's good enough. So, 
So that's it, how you make it, okay? And then we're gonna do the standardization of this primary standard, okay? And I'm gonna show you next time how you're gonna do calibrate on this, okay? I, I run you through the second part. All right, Terry's out now. Okay, have a good day, bye.